excited. Blue Amethyst Hello, shell child. Shells. Child. Shells. 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 Wow. Shells. Hello, shells. Children. Shells and children. <laughs> and, 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 and. I can speak English. What are you talking about? <laughs> Yay, fan fiction. So, I'm gonna kill myself I, I don't after honestly know this. why she found this. And yeah. this is like our third time trying to read this without messing up the video. So, yeah. yeah. This is sad. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yay. Okay. You can start off. Yeah. I'm gonna try to do my annoying 12 year old girl voice again. Yay! <laughs> I'm Tammy. Right. Wrong thing. <laughs> I'm ready to get actual fresh for some yummy. I'm a great singer. Ah, ham. Asterisk. A H E M. Asterisk. So this will just be a little story of a fight. I'll see. Friend to the end! Wait, my house is a Neko because I'm so creative, haha! It's not like anyone else has that, it's not like it's, like, you know, stupid. I'm making this up as I go along here because I'm so quirky and relatable. <laughs> so this is like an alternate universe where not all monsters are sealed underground because that makes sense and doesn't ruin the plot whatsoever. Ha 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 ha. Ha uh ha. -huh. Monsters that were a lot like people, like Lusswise, I just like now, yeah. Set up of ground. So, Knuckles, uh, vampires, maybe? Yeah, I don't know. Don't ask me. I don't know. Why are you asking me? Stop patronizing me. Oh my god. <laughs> so, now it's like really long now, so like, I'll shut up. Like, shut up now. Like, yeah. Oh, by the way, I have like a human soul thing. It's like bravery. Don't like ask how it works. Lol. XD, 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 XD. XO, 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 XO. Tildy, 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 tildy. That was great. 10 out of 10. Thank you. Okay, so so you then. Got you plopped down on the dirt trail and looked up at the sky. It was a pretty nice day out, barely in the clouds, light breeze, perfect for the hike she was taking. Wow, I'm really out of shape, Kay said, laying down on the beaten dirt path. She took a sip from a water bottle and sat back up. <laughs> she stretched and looked at the mountain ahead of her. Her brother, Jack, had dared her to climb it, and Katya never turned down a no! To prove Never. she went up there, though, her brother wanted her to get a flower that grew up there. Katya wiped her forehead <laughs> and looked back down on the town. It looked so small from there. Please, just kill me. Better get going. I should get back before dark. She said to herself, the little kitty gets grimy with her bedtime story. Sometime later, I'm not going to do a good transition, kill yourself. I mean, deal with it. Finally! Katya said, reaching the top, there was a cave off to the side that wasn't suspicious at all. <laughs> Presumably where the flowers were, they probably have drugs in them, and then my friend's, um, Jack, his brother, sorry, is gonna come up here and he's gonna rape me. <laughs> oh. She wanted to see her this moment. Wow, she said, awestruck. The sun was just starting to set, and it was beautiful. The sky was a rush of, a wash of, a, a rush of red. I said it again. <laughs> a wash of red, gold, pink, and purple. Hold on. Osamatsu, <laughs> Jiyushimatsu, Todomatsu, the gay one, and Ichimatsu. It's all the colors. Oh. just need two more. I just need green and blue. Nice. Right. A light breeze ruffled Katya's light brown hair. Her cat ears twitched. Where is it? She said as she walked through the cave. The cave was, in a way, more beautiful than the sunset. Huge crystals were growing on the ceiling. Oh, wait, what? 
What? <laughs> what? <laughs> You're interrupting me. I'm sorry. Okay. Huge Go. crystals were growing on the ceiling. There were vines with little white flower buds climbing the walls. And all the way across the cave were little blue flowers in full bloom. Huh. Those must be the ones Jack <laughs> talked about. <laughs> Katya said, taking a few steps forward. Her green eyes were focused on the flowers, not looking in front of her. There we... Uh, Katya began to say... <laughs> Katya made, <laughs> Katya made what could be a fatal mistake. She didn't look around, so she didn't notice the huge and seemingly bottomless pit. Katya looked down at her, and she fell, her hair flying wildly around her. Well, she said relatively calmly, guess I won't be there to read you your story, little kitty. She hit the ground, she died. End of story, okay, bye! The end of this video. No. <laughs> Katya groaned, opening her eyes. She blinked. Wait, I'm alive? Question mark. I'm alive! Ha 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 She stood up and threw her arms up victoriously. Wait, how do I get out of here? She said, realizing her, t her situation. She looked around. It was a small room. <laughs> it had small piles of rocks everywhere, and she appeared to be standing on a little plot of golden flowers. There was a stick nearby. Katya picked it up, just in case. <laughs> Straight ahead was a long hallway. Katya started walking that way, Cat tail. <laughs> Cat <nervously>. tail. <laughs> yeah. At the end of the hall was a doorway into another room, and in that room was a flower. But this flower had a face, a little smiling <laughs> face, <laughs> staring right at Cat. Yeah, it was pretty creepy, actually. But and walked towards it. Maybe it knew the way out? Uh, hi, Katya mm. said, waving slightly. Hi! The flower said, making Katya jump. I'm Flowey! Flowey the flower! You don't oh. say, Katya muttered. Mm. You really are! I'm a mumbler! So much. Flowey continued. Golly, Katya mumble, mumbled. Who says mumbled. that? Mumbled. 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 <laughs> of course, the best character in the game says golly. Duh. Duh. <laughs> Katya mumbled. Shumbred. Okay, no. <laughs> Out my throat. <clears> throat> Ready? Oh, what? Here we go! Suddenly, a small, bright orange heart appeared where Katya's actual heart was. Whoa! Katya said, jumping back as if to get away from the floating heart. What the? <sighs> Hit those high notes. <laughs> oh, Flowey said, eyeing it slightly. Katya oh, hugged the heart it. close to her. This flower was pretty sketchy. <laughs> I'm dying. Oh. <laughs> <coughs> what was that? Okay. <laughs> What's love stand for? My love of course. Love me, please, love her. Oh, Flowey said, smiling. You want some love, don't you? 
you're the low notes. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Ah ha 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 no. Ha 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 ha. No, that's okay. Katya started to say. A burst of little white floating things appeared around the still smiling flower. No, you just start rapping. Ha 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 <laughs> he looked to the side as he said that. Are you ready? Is your body ready for this? Uh, uh, no. Move around. Get as ready as you can. This is a ASMR now. Flowey said okay. cheerfully. The pellet like zoomed to cheerful. the orange heart. Katya tried to dodge, but one barely caught her. HP, 1 out of 20. Ah! What did you do? Katya turned on Flowey, more mad than hurt. You idiot! Oh, Flowey cried. In this world, it's kill or be killed! Oh, boy. Katya growled at Flowey. Soul, this hurts my soul. Am I really not new on Tessa? No. I don't really like that. Your turn. Die. <laughs> the voice crack. I just want to say. Night. 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 Please. Okay. Hey, I already read my line. Uh, what? I said it's your line. I was speaking. I said I said die. It was so quiet you couldn't hear it. Uh, well, well, okay. Well, okay. That's, Wh that's whatever. Ne next chapter. Next chapter. That's awkward. So uh, I. Yeah, that that uh, awkward silence. Chapter. I had a little line. Thing, the fruit of one cocky all fell and woke up. But I got so weird, so yeah. But you have to do your twelve-year-old voice. Begin. Oh. Hi. Flower yelled as the pellet closed in. Katya looked around frantically. Maybe she could find something to help? That stick she dropped? No. Random rocks out of her reach? No. Wait, a door! A yes, a door! door. There oh was God. a door behind the flower, but there was no way she could make it. Help! Katya cried. If there was a door, maybe there was someone else nearby that might not kill her. Then, the pellets disappeared. Uh... Flowey said, obviously confused. Just as he finished his, sen his sentence, a huge ball of fire blasted the demon plant away. Demon plant. Covering her eyes, Katya looked away. I'm okay. A motherly I'm voice asked. <laughs> Neko looked up to see Neko! a really tall goat Go! lady. Go! I, uh... Yeah, yeah, Katya stammered. No, it's the goat person yeah. offered her hand. Katya took it and stood up. Do not worry, my child. I won't harm you, I guess. I'll just sign myself and say I want to kill myself. I'm sorry, I can't take care of the room. Toriel said. <laughs> I eyed Toriel warily. <laughs> I promise you won't hurt me. Warily. <laughs> warily. <laughs> Toriel smiled. I don't promise. I mean, I do promise. I'm um, guide you or whatever. I hate kids. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Edgy Toriel. 
Okay. Toriel walked through the door. Kaido followed close behind as to avoid the demon flower from attacking again. Everyone's there are like puzzles or whatever. Like, get used to them. You how? I don't care about your well being. Like, whatever. Okay. <laughs> ah! <laughs> My microphone. Okay. <clears throat> Okay. Katya nodded somewhat enthusiastically. He loved puzzles, but she, oh, she would put together puzzles with Jack at home all the time. Oh man, no. Bad Katya. No getting emo- emotional in front of this nice lady who saved you from, the, from a devil oh, plan. Dad? What's your name? Satan child? I mean, kid. Toyo asked, interrupting Katya from her thoughts. Oh, uh, Katya, Katya replied. And how old are you, you dumb slut? I mean, my child. (laughs) Sixteen. Totally not an edgy twelve-year-old. Oh, that's legal in Japan. Take my hand. (laughs) Oh. That's illegal. Oh, wow. Okay. Toriel said, a seemingly impassable floor of spikes were ahead. Katya took her hand. Toriel walked on and Katya followed. The spikes disappeared beneath them as they walked on a specific trail. Puzzles aren't dangerous at all, but I want to give you no experience or knowledge whatsoever so you have a higher chance of dying. Okay, kill yourself. I hate you. Oh. <laughs> Toriel said, letting go of Katya's Katya? hand. Okay, okay. <laughs> Katya said. Okay. As they continued walking past the sorted puzzle, a large white frog thing appeared Don't in call front it of Katya. It's a frog at you, ho. It's a frog <laughs> thing. <laughs> frog. So, frog thing. Okay. Okay. The orange soul was visible. Uh, this is a good time for a demonstration. I. Yes. The dummy that was usually in the back room, in the room back there wasn't. He probably like hates me or something. I don't know. I kind of like raped him 27 times. So, as the human monsters will attack you, do not fight. I mean, you could fight, but like, whatever. Spare them, I guess. Strike up a conversation or whatever. I don't care. I want you to die. I mean, I was up like. <coughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> wow. Okay. Don't fight, Katya said, but what if they hurt me? <gasps> oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, uh, you can dodge their attacks or whatever, but I'd prefer it if you got hurt. So you'd be more vulnerable. <clears throat> said Toriel. The frog became impatient impatient and attacked. Little white fly things fly flew for the neck for the neckos. Neckos Necko But Cat and dodged them all with surprising speed. Act compliment. Frog didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Toriel looked happy. Oh my god, I hate you so much. Much. No, like, spare them. They'll leave you alone or whatever, but I want you to die. Mercy. Uh. Fair. You won! You got zero XP and two gold. Ha ha ha! Wait, no. Did you see that? I dodged all of that frog of that frog attack. It was awesome! Katya exclaimed. No, it wasn't. Toriel laughed. Toriel killed herself. Uh, oh. You did great, I guess. I have a favor to ask of you. Turn around, count to 30, and walk to the end of this hall by yourself. That'll give me enough time to see if I can kill myself in 15 seconds or less. Go. Oh. Uh, okay. Kaya said, looking <laughs> a bit worried as she turned. One, two, three... At the end, Katya turned around with Toriel nowhere to be seen. 
almost <laughs> like it was hide and seek. Katya walked down the long hallway quickly, feeling like she was going to get jump scared. Ooh, it's five oh, nights at Freddy's yeah. now. She's omnipotent. Yeah, omnipotent. <laughs> okay. At the end of the hall stood a white pillar, similar to the ones seen all over the ruins. But behind the pillar was Torio. Katya ran oh. faster, nearly tripping over a rock. She nice. hated being left and alone. Why would she trip? <laughs> yeah, why would she trip? Torio walked out from behind the pillar as Katya approached. Oh my god, I hate you. I wasn't gone, though. I want you to fucking kill yourself. Oh my god. Katya grinned. Oh, Katya grinned. She seemed to like that. Look. A little exercise to see if you'd kill yourself if I left. I wish you did. Katya's smile. Oh, oh, Katya's smile faltered. Oh, I'm Aaron's and uh, uh, yeah. yeah, quote unquote Aaron's. I have errands. I need to go um pay back the guy from the mafia who loaned me like twenty million dollars. Yeah. I mean, I need to run errands. Go. <laughs> take, 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 thing. Okay, Toriel handed Katya a small metal rectangle. It's a meta- it's a cell phone. It's a meta- <laughs> <laughs> If you need me, call. See you soon, you dumb slut. He's <laughs> underage. And with that, Toriel dumb... left the room. You dumb slut. <laughs> wow. Well. Katya flopped onto the floor next to the pillar and looked at the phone. It was a flip phone with small with a small scratch on the front. Oh. <laughs> it wouldn't let her text at all and the camera was busted, but it was better than nothing. How did I end up in this situation? Katya thought to herself. It was just a dare to get some flowers and next thing I know I get beat up by a talking plant and saved by a goat mom. Katya sighed. I just want to go home and read you that story, little kitty. She began, to, she began to tear up. No, I'm not gonna wait. I'm gonna go ask Torio how to get out of here. Okay. Katya stood up and put the phone in her pocket. She left the room, prepared to face whatever was outside it. That I like how this was a goat mom. I'm crying. <laughs> Okay, let's hear part three, and then we'll end it. Okay. <laughs> Kill me. Okay. <clears throat> part three! Yeah. Oh. I know. I know, I'm not completely following Undertale, but whatever, it's just a doofy fanfiction. Doofy isn't a word. Doofy's jacket. Also, sorry if this seems rushed, I only got an hour to make this one enjoy. Not what I was expecting, oh Katya said as she walked into the next room. She was Steps expecting- into the next oh. room. Oh, okay. <laughs> What? Whatever. She was expecting all these traps and puzzles, but instead there was a frogget from earlier. Two Higher. branching rooms, two pile of leaves, and a yellow glowing what thing. Glowing thing. Oh, what's this? Katya said as she approached it. Against all common oh, sense, right. she reached out and touched it. Oh, playfully nice. crink, playfully crinkling or to the not. leaves, filled you with bravery. <laughs> I was okay. gonna read the saves! Oh, 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 oh whatever. I'm okay, triggered. Katya jumped back, whipping her head from side to side, looking for the voice that said that. Right, can you hear me? The voice said. Uh, yeah. Who Whore. are you? Whore you. W whatever. There's no punctuation to be whore you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A sigh was heard, and a figure appeared. It was a transparent 
it wait, it was transparent it was and was transparent. wearing a green and yellow striped sweater and had a Beep. golden locket. Are they a Necro too? Oh my god. <laughs> oh god. Okay. No. They had short brown hair and eyes that looked red. Not irritated red. Actually red. Hot. Hot. It do it too. Okay. My dog. You see on. I'm here. I've been following you because as a ghosty ghost gear, there's not much to do. It turns out you're a slut, so I mean, might not have been the best choice to fall down here. A ghost? Cool. I'm friends with a ghost, Katya said, jumping slightly. Yeah, okay, I'm not your friend, but you have fun there. Kara said, leaning back and rolling her eyes, rolling their eyes. Well, I just triggered her. Just, oh, I said it again. I'll just, I'm triggering her. gen. I'm triggering. <laughs> I'm, I'm assuming her gender. Insert clip of triggered skeleton here. You oh, better wow. do that in editing. I will kill you if you don't. Okay. I'll just okay. follow you around, the, I guess. You dumb slut. Okay. No. Okay, the Neko the walked Neko. into the, the Neko walked into Neko. the northern room. It was a bowl with candies in it. This is please take one take a candy. Katya grabbed a candy. Please take one take another. Katya grabbed another candy. How disgusting, you f fat whore. It says, please take one, take another. Katya grabbed another. You feel like a fat slut, the scum of the earth, it says. I get it, Katya said, leaving the room with the three candies in hand, shoving them in her pocket. Jeez, it's a bit rude, you dumb slut. Jesus Christ, calm yourself. To read this part too. Oh, a few rooms and assorted puzzles later. These transitions are gonna be sucky because I can't swear because I'm a twelve-year-old. So I accept it. Yep. For nothing. Go. Oh, oh, okay. Oh my God, Katya flopped onto the floor. Kara hovering beside her. I'm still so out of shape. You should work out more, you dumb slut. Kara says, laughing a bit. I don't want to hear anything from you, ghosty, Katya said, getting to her feet. Ghosty, how if you call me that one more time, I will rip your throat out? Kara said, Bite glaring me. at Katya. Katya ignored her and walked into the next room. It was another ghost. Hey, ghosty, I found you a friend. <laughs> Kara exclaimed, rolling her eyes. Chara. The girls keep saying out loud, repeatedly move it with force. Um, hi, a ghost. Katya said, reaching out. Almost immediately, her soul was drawn out, and she entered the battle. Ha 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 ha! Whoa! No, to be no. Need to be hasty, buddy. Here comes maps to block. I'll do the background music. <laughs> okay. Flirt. Hey there, good looking. Katya said, winking. <laughs> Hold on, stop. Stop for a second. Stop for a second. Oh, are you really gonna do this? Yes, I am! Okay. <laughs> I need to do- okay. Um, continue. Oh, well, it's kind of your- your line. I just wrote it down. Napsa Blue said, then he started crying. But instead of acting like normal tears, they flew towards Katya's soul. Luckily, Katya dodged most of them, save for a stray one that beelined for her. HP, 17 out of 20. 
Kara, wait, did you read that? Yeah, I did. Okay, Kara said, holding back a laugh. Shut up, Katya muttered. I'm trying to concentrate. Ah. Cheer. You're doing really good, Katya grinned, giving a thumbs up. <laughs> Naps the book said, looking less sad. Still, the tears attacked. Okay, Katya mumbled, sliding to the left to avoid it here. Kara said, got it. Ah. Cheer. You're great at this, Katya smiled, sliding to the right to avoid an attack. Not to look much, sorry, something. The tears, the flood of tears redirected themselves to the top of Nasta Blue's ghostly head, forming a top hat. We call it Dapper Blue, do you like it? Cat, you nodded. You won! You got zero XP and five gold. I win! <laughs> I'm better than you, I sang. Oh, nice. Kill yourself, kill yourself, kill yourself, kill yourself, kill yourself, kill yourself, kill yourself. No. Re read your line. Uh, well, usually I can't the real ones because it's all around, but today I actually met someone nice. So I'm rambling, I'll leave you be. Kill yourself. That's the book disappeared. <laughs> Bye, Katya waved. You're trying to kill you and you just wave bye? Wow, you're a dumb slight. Kara said, I am Katya. You're trying, yep. to, you're trying to have sex with them? Is that what you're doing? <laughs> That's what you're doing? Is this what we're doing? Are you seriously yeah. gonna do that when you're literally, you're literally about to die? Oh my god. Okay, wow. Okay. <laughs> yep, Katya said, walking onwards. Kara wow, rolled their eyes, yes. following. They passed the room with three frogs. Waved to a small frog in the wall, oh and I got through a, bo a button puzzle. Oh, I thought it said smash the frog onto the wall. Smash the <laughs> frog onto the wall. Wow. <laughs> it smashed the frog onto the wall. <laughs> With Kara's help. Ugh. How, fa how Ugh. much farther is it? Katya asked Kara. Not much far further, you should be patient, you dumb slut. Kara said, drifting ahead. Say. Kara pointed to the end of the hall. Yay, I don't have to walk anymore, Katya exclaimed, sprinting forward. I read another part as you inside me. Wow. <laughs> No! I can't read! Uh, go. Wow. <laughs> okay. uh, um, what's happening? It, it's the tutorial uh, part. Oh, uh, what? Oh my god. <laughs> you not know <laughs> where we are. I couldn't hear you. Fine, I'll, I'll read it. it. Yay, I won't have to walk anymore, Katya exclaimed. Uh, 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 it took longer than I thought it would. It really didn't. I had to raise $20 million, so I mean... <sighs> A voice said. Katya's phone rang. <laughs> oh. You. Uh, <laughs> okay. Toyo said, <laughs> rushing to Katya. You hurt? Oh, I really hope you are. Uh, I'm fine, Katya said. Shit. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, like, come in. Dumb slut. I hate you so much. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, wow. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Toyo grabbed Katya's hand and walked in. Out of nowhere, fucking kill yourself. Great. The sign of such a tiny house in the room is filled with bravery. Do you. Oh, wait, that's you. You smell that? 
Khalil said, turning to look at Katya. I might do a butterscotch cinnamon pie. It actually has shit in it. I thought I would sip tonight. Oh, okay. <laughs> Katya's eyes lit up. I love pie. Toriel smiled. That's great. I don't care. Why are you telling me this? Okay, come here. <sighs> Toriel walked to the right and showed Katya a door. Come with you around so that you won't have to be anywhere near me because I hate you. Toriel said that Toriel set a hand on Katya's head. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, I think it's burning. I really hope it doesn't want you to be disgusted in first. Okay, I like, go to sleep or whatever. I don't care. <sighs> Toriel rushed, to Toriel rushed to another room. Katya entered the room. It looked like it belonged to another kid at some point. Asriel, Katya gonna... saw a bed and I'm... realized how tired she was. Sorry, I don't want to look around. Are you fall asleep? What the fuck is Kara crazy? said. Zzz. 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 Okay. Oh, okay. Yep, yep, she did. Kara said, floating next to her. Good night, my old fucking bitch. <laughs> oh, new ship. <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> no. Yes. No. Cat Yak and Kara confirmed. No. Okay, that's it! So all we're gonna do is it's already been like 35 minutes or 40 minutes or something. Oh, wow. Okay, goodbye, goodbye, friends. Goodbye, childrens.